everyone. Today we're going to make mushu wrap, and that is a wrap for all kinds of mushu, such as mushu shrimp. So the other day I was making mushu shrimp, and I could not find the mushu wrap anywhere in the stores. So I decided to make my own. So here I am making it my own version of mushu wrap. I have here one and a half cups of all-purpose flour, and I mix it with hot water. Using a chopstick to move it around until it is cool enough, um, so that you can use your hand and knead it into a dough. You can also use a spatula if you don't have a chopstick. So you keep kneading it for about 10 to 15 minutes until it turns into a dough, just like this. And then you're going to add some cooking oil, and then you're going to toss it around until all the surface is covered with oil. Then you leave it for 30 minutes and then you take it out and knead it again. And you're going to knead it and then poke a hole in the middle to make it into a circle, just like this. And keep turning it around around until it's form a circle, then you break it into two parts and roll it with your hand until all the parts are even equal size and then you're going to cut it into six parts and that is six equal parts now you're going to Flatten it with your hand, with the palm of your hand, just like that. So you do it all for the six pieces. And now we're going to put a little bit more oil onto the dough and spread it out and then put one piece on top of the other just like that and then flatten it some more with the palm of your hand and then roll it out with a rolling pin so you keep rolling it until it flattens out and try to flatten it out as much as you can to spread the dough out Once it is all flattened out and spread out, you can use like a bowl, like a soup bowl, to cut it so that it forms into a round shape. So that is how you form a round shape. And now your wrap is ready to be cooked. So I have here a heated pan and I'm going to add some oil and make sure your pan is hot and then make sure the oil is evenly covered and lay your dough onto the pan and let it cook on low heat until it forms bubbles. Then turn to the other side and wait until it forms bubbles again and turns golden brown, just like that. Then your dough is ready. So you wait until it cools down so that you can handle it with your finger and split it open into two layers, just like that so that you can make two wraps in one dough. Just like that. So anytime you make mushu, you can make your own wraps easily. And believe me, it is even more tasty than the store-bought. I also made a mushu shrimp video. Please check it out in the link below. Thank you so much for watching.
and happy cooking!